All right, so class three, ready to change your class again, level 38. You got two options again. You go the light path, you go the dark path. Well, you're gonna stick with the light. You're gonna stand in the light and you're gonna go light path. You're gonna take the divine fist. Well, let's see what he has in store for you. So first things first, with the uh, new class, you're gonna get a new, a uh, couple new abilities. You're going to get the passive uh, at 4% of CS gauge every 5 seconds. Um, this is this is good because throughout the fight you will be, uh, you know, it's it's just nice to have more more uh, CS gauge. And the Divine Fist um, is centered around class strikes. Alrighty, so... Again, you get uh, another class strike with the uh, class change. Uh, this one, you get the Byako Wave. Uh, this is the Goku uh, Spirit Bomb. Now, this one is kind of... Uh, it's good, I'll say that. It is good. But it's unwieldy in the fact that it can miss, and it can whiff, and it's extremely slow. But it is a single... It is a multi multi uh, target. Uh, it's in a big AOE. It's one single hit. It's just a one and done. Um, so uh, it's it's good. Spin kick still probably better. Uh, yeah, I, I would say it's better. This one is um, well. We'll fool around with it a bit later. You, you'll see. It it, it has some. Um, it's one of those love it or hate it type things. When it works, you're like, wow, this is awesome. When it doesn't, you know, you're like, wow. Just, wow. Alrighty. Same deal. Uh, the first three abilities, you get three abilities uh, per class. So, class one, that would be neutral. That would be your grappler. Um, class two, we had a choice, light or dark. We went with, with the light. We were the monk, and we got these three here. Your third uh, class uh, choice again. You have uh, light or dark. Uh, we went with the light path here, and this is what we get. So, as you can tell, lots of strength. He's just piling on the strength, and it's gonna keep coming. So, we got class strike damage increased by 25% when HP is at max. So what this means is obviously you're going to want to stay at 100%, but also is this is the speed. Mm, I mean, this just synergizes well with, uh, with uh, what's it called? Spin kick. Yeah, spin kick. So you're going to start the fight with the spin kick. You're going to get the big damage. And you're just going to move on. Um, so th this is quite nice. He becomes uh, the light path. The divine fist is the CS strike spam class. This is what this is what the light gets. So the warrior monk got some s support. You know, party support. This is the single target. Um... Not the single target. This is the multi-target uh, class strike class. And he's actually really good at it. Same deal. You're going to have 9 points into... Let's just bump this up to max. You're going to have 9 points into stamina. You're just going to leave it there for the attack boost. It's it's really good. Meditation. You want to go uh, 27 for meditation now. So what meditation does is it gives you... Uh, meter. 7% every 5 seconds. So, this is, like I said, the class strike class. You're going to want all the meter you can. You're going to want to do class strikes as often as you can. Same deal here. Uh, whereas the warrior monk, so these three will change depending whether you go uh, the divine fist, warrior monk. The warrior monk got multi-target healing light, which is, uh, which is good. I mean, if, if he's going to be a support role, that's, you know. And he got Leaf Saber, 
So there's no attack saber here. Um, and no sabers. But he does get nature aura. And what this does is it increases CS gauge gain by 50%. So as you can see, once we're you know once we start uh, you know putting all this together, he's he's definitely the monster. Same deal here, revive. Revive is amazing. So let's just read what it says: 50% chance of reducing total amount of CS gauge used by 50% when using a class strike. So this doesn't refund like payback does. Payback, you know, if if, if a class strike is going to cost 200. You're going to do the 200, but then you're going to get some back. With this one, Revive, um, you just have, you know, a uh, 50% chance of it just decreasing. So this is, this is really good, and the fact that you're going to want Broken Lines at this point in the game, um, it just max it out. So he is kind of, um, I mean, it's easy for me to do this now, because, you know, I'm max level, I have, you know, 315 points. But you're really going to be strapped once you once you hit 38. So, um, but there's a lot of good abilities. Uh, I would I would do spirit first. So immediately go into to strength. Um, go into spirit. Um, probably luck and then intelligence. That's probably the best. So let's just learn all this junk and we'll go and. Uh, show you how uh, how OP he is. Alright. They really need a uh, faster way to do all this. Alright, so uh, new class change, you're going to get some new moves, new combos. So uh, as you know, we got a four hit normal, normal string with the monk. This is not changing. What changes here is we get a finisher off of this. So four hits and a finisher. So one, two, three, four, and look at all that. Lots of damage, lots of crits, lots of chances for uh, debuffs if you know you're gonna put them on there. He's just really good. Again, nothing in the air changes. Same old, same old. You can do that in the air if you want. No need. All right, so let's head down here and uh, beat up on our friends. So the first thing, um, let's just load these out. Uh, that and that and that. So what do I want to show you first? Well, let's just show you the class strike first. So let's get in here. Let's build the meter. Okay, we got it. And we're at, and it's nighttime, so we're gonna get the wolf form. That's good. All right, so let's show you here. Boom. Just obliterated. Uh, there is issues though where they may just flat out whiff. See? Completely miss these guys. Because um, of how slow it is. So it's 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 really hard to say. Um uh, hit hitting all of them, but it has a pretty sizable AOE. I'll just keep doing this to, just to show you. Let's see where we are. So total whiff. Um, you know, it's it's again, it's a love love it or hate it type thing. Um, when it hits, you're gonna feel really good. You know, you're gonna be like, wow. Um, spin kick, uh, spin kick is just. It's incredibly cheap. Does good damage, good AOE. Um, you're 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 gonna clip something. You're you're gonna be hitting and clipping something. So let's just break this. Look at that. It just it just it just destroys him. And it's crazy. So on top of his uh, good uh, normals, he just has the class strike stuff. So let's look at. Let's go and put some of his uh, his stuff on just to see how how crazy he kind of gets. Stat boost, you're definitely gonna want this. So payback, 
um, I would do stat boost, um, I would do victory, I would do meditation, uh, I mean, revive, you're gonna want it, one hit clash strike, I, I mean it's only 5%, but then again this is 5% per enemy, so it helps. Uh, this is mandatory, I, w I would say. This is mandatory. So for now, you could you could either do this if you're going to be um, running through an area. This will help keep your uh, CS gauge um, topped off. And you would switch it out for a boss fight for, I suppose, uh, Broken Lines too. Then again, Broken Lines is a chain skill. So you can give it to any other of your uh, any of your your other uh, members, but you know he can be self-sufficient here. Um, he should just put it on really easily. So wow, come on now. Here we go. He's a big boy. Wow. Well, crit. We'll just do this. See, I mean, the the issue with Kevin is, I mean, even now, at, at you know, at level 99, I he has what uh, 278 attack. Um, it's, I mean, I wish I could go lower so I can actually show you, but I mean, he just does so much damage. Uh, so it's really, again, you really don't need broken lines for any of this stuff. Um, let's see if I can get, get it on him. Come on now. So, yeah, he's debuffed, and then you just... It's just... its This is why you don't need uh, Necro, or... Um, I mean, e even Reese. But, then again, this wasn't the, the actual comp I was using. This was just for videos and uh, whatnot. So, let's take off the... OP skills here and show you what kind of meter he can get off of the hmm I don't know do do I do it or not I mean cuz this is this is more like build this is more like <laughs> party building stuff but I mean you could use this uh, the one hit uh, class strike boost so um, we'll just throw it on there just because we'll just do it so we'll just do some uh, party stuff here why not all right let's let's just go in here and oh of course you want to keep topped off there you go and let's see what happens So we got about 160 there. Um, let's see. Let's see. So that's not going to trigger anything. So I mean the the gain's pretty good. Um, it's you just want to build them up, and uh, so I mean he's already at. 200. What do we want to do here? Let's just do this. So, he uh, doesn't quite have all of the tools that he needs to get the CS through kills. However, this is what he can do. So, he has Nature Aura. What this does will increase CS gain. So, You can see he's, I mean, just a simple combo, he's, he's all the way up here. But what he can also do is increase his attack and just gain it through there. Look at that. So he's 38 per cast. So this is one way. You just... And... We're there. And now we're ready to drop a super. So this is the spam build. It will get better with the fourth class, but you know, this is uh, we're talking about the divine fist here. Let's just build up. So this is what we get. 
25. 25. Nature Aura. And 38. 38. And when you get hit, you're getting extra. The uh, passives. You're getting 17. Just standing here. 17. Just running around. There we are. You want to get it higher. You just do this. And you're ready to... Look at that. We just got 270. 270 back. Because we had the... Oh, and it whiffed. Well, <laughs> okay, so this is a good example of why it, it's a love it or hate it. But you saw that we just gained 270 off of that special. And that's because of revive and payback. Still missed. So it's, uh, you know, love it or hate it. But if, it, if the stars align, this is a uh, incredibly powerful class. Um, again, the pressure point only works for Kevin, but Nature Aura, this will work for anyone. Pressure points, Kevin only, but I mean, even even as a uh, you know pseudo support role, uh, you know you can let's just give it to her. Say, look at that. So 2% instead of 1%. Um, there we are. Let's see. So 10. So, I mean, it's it's still... He still has some uh, party uses. Um, the, the heal really isn't um, that useful. It's useful for him, I guess. You know, when you're, when you're going from pack to pack, you want to keep him at max uh, HP for the... One hit class boost. Um, you use stat boost to gain your your meter back just by in, in in fight just by spamming your attack up. Also, you get attack up by spamming attack up, so so that's good. You get the payback, um, especially when you're throwing out 300 for the spirit bomb. You're gonna get a, a noticeable increase back. Uh, revive, if it if it happens like like you saw when we just got uh, 270 back just like that. Um, one hit class strike you want to keep it up I mean you, he has some synergy with some other classes such as Charlotte uh, even this but you know again the, the spirit bomb will whiff a lot and um, you know you could you could use his single target ones but um, he doesn't he actually really doesn't have any of these the spin kicks multi hit his final his final one is a single target but the the AOE is uh, it's not as good as the other ones so this is the CS spam class strike spec uh, has some party utility with nature aura um, he has healing light not that important and the final thing would be uh, I suppose he still has the the high attack. I mean, attack's really high. Um, and so he's just going to be doing damage even if you close your eyes and mash. So, very good class. Very, very good. Um, he got a massive uh, strength increase. Um, well, power increase, I would say, from, the, from going from 2 to 3. He got a lot of goodies. Spin kick. Uh, spirit bomb. Spam. Alright, so... I'm going to call it here. Uh, I'll see you guys again. Take care.